setting up emulation on the iPhone. Let's talk about that. Hello and welcome to Modern Broadcast. In today's episode, we're going to be looking at installing emulators and ROMs on our iPhone device, uh, utilizing Alt Store and Delta, which are third-party applications. We're going to be installing this with a Windows PC, uh, so let's go ahead and get started. All right, so switching over to our Windows PC here, uh, in order to get ROMs and emulators on our iPhone device, uh, we need to utilize something called Alt Store. Um, then we'll be installing Delta, which is kind of like the retro arch of Apple. Um, so this is the Alt Store website. It's just altstore.io. It is a, a home for apps that push the boundaries of iOS. No jailbreak required. Down here at the bottom, at the tail bottom, it says Alt Store, Delta, and Clip are properties of Alt Store LLC and are in no way associated with Nintendo or Apple. This does work for Mac OS and Windows. Since I have a Windows machine, um, I'm just going to go ahead and click the Windows button here. And that is going to download the Alt Installer. Up here at the top, um, I have the FAQ from the Alt Store, and it's how to install on Windows. And before installing, we have to download iTunes and iCloud directly from Apple and not through the Microsoft Store. All right, after extracting the Alt Installer zip, I'm going to go ahead and delete that, and we'll want to run the setup. After running the setup, down here in our taskbar, we'll have a little icon. Um, for the alt store here after running the alt installer setup I uh, would close that and what we need to do is then plug in our iPhone and open up the iTunes we're gonna click this icon here and under summary we need to scroll down to sync with this iPhone over Wi-Fi down here at the bottom with that um, alt store now we're going to install alt store and click on your phone name there. You may get a prompt to log in. Go ahead and do so. After a few seconds, you'll get a notification that it was installed successfully. But in order to boot it, we need to click on settings, general. Then we need to click on VPN and device management, developer app. You should see your email there and you wanna click on trust, whatever your email address is for the alt store. Now we can open up the alt store and we see here that we have news. If we go to browse, these are the different applications that we can install on our iPhone. Uh, so what we're gonna be focusing on is Delta and scrolling down, we want the Dolphin iOS. And we'll now see in my apps that we have the Delta active, Dolphin iOS and alt store. We'll also see that it expires in seven days. So this is kind of the the catch with um, doing it non-jailbroken is we have to connect our phone to the same Wi-Fi as our computer and we have to sign in to Alt Store before it expires in that seven days and we have to click on the days and it will refresh. So um, if it goes past that seven days, you basically have to go back to your computer, go down to the bottom, and install Alt Store again, and uh, reinstall that app onto your phone. But if we go back to our iTunes, we click our little phone icon, and we go to File Sharing, we can click Delta. I created this ROMs folder, and we can drag and drop ROMs for Game Boy, Game Boy Advance, into here. And under Dolphin iOS, we can drag and drop our GameCube games here. So far, I just have Animal Crossing here. Uh, so that's all I'm going to use for this test here. Um, but if you end up adding a lot, you might want to create a folder that uh, allows you to kind of better manage that. So let's go ahead and hook this up to our controller and uh, see if it works. So I went ahead and put on Game Boy Advance games. Here we have Pokemon uh, Red version for the Game Boy Advance. Um, just gonna go ahead and test out this with the uh, Backbone One controller. As you can see, it's actually working really well. Um, and I just did a review of this controller uh, last week. Uh, so if you haven't checked out that video, I strongly recommend you give it a shot. And it looks like 
We're about to die here. Uh, okay, I guess water gun. Uh, let's see. Hopefully we can get through this. Nice. Okay. Oh, boy. I don't know if we're going to make... Okay, he's got another one. Uh... Okay. Oh, good. <laughs> Anyways. Um... Uh, switching things up, we have a Sonic Adventure. Um, or Sonic Advance, I'm sorry, not Adventure. <laughs> Again, for the Game Boy Advance. Uh, so Delta can support multiple different systems. Uh, I think all the way up to, I think the newest system is now Nintendo DS. Um, I, I just didn't have time to go ahead and put that together yet. But uh, testing out some Game Boy Advance here. And the screen looks great. The sound sounds amazing. And um, yeah, this controller really is a game changer. Uh, when playing. The on-screen controls uh, that Delta offers isn't bad at all. It's just uh, a lot better having the physical buttons, in my opinion. So here we are uh, with the Dolphin emulator for iOS, and for whatever reason, it is failing. Um, it says failed to contact alt jit uh, debug server error minus 256. Uh, I looked into that error code, and I, for whatever reason, um, there's some sort of bug in the, um, the latest release of the Dolphin, um, where it's just not communicating with our computer. Uh, to enable that. Hopefully that will get fixed promptly um, at this time of making this video. GameCube is not working on the iPhone um, on the latest build uh, according to the threads that I found looking into that error code. Uh, if you know a workaround or if you know a way to fix this issue, uh, please leave a comment down below. Uh, you'll not only be helping me, uh, but you'll be helping uh, your fellow viewers. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please consider leaving a like and subscribe. Don't forget to join the Modern Broadcast Program. For $1.99 a month, you can be channel surfing or upgrade to the VHS package for $4.99 a month where you'll also get exclusive live streams where we get to chat more one-on-one -on -one and also a free Steam game every month. Have a great week, everyone, and take care.